Welcome to the unspeakable truths that the rest of the world will be saying in the coming years. Uh, this week, the, the unforgivable. They're unforgivable. Truths. They're un, They're unforgivable. They're They're certainly speakable by us. For everyone else, they're unspeakable until a few years have passed. Then everyone else will act like they've been saying it all along when they haven't. Yeah, after it becomes safe. Yeah, keep in mind all of your supposedly favorite supposed culture war YouTubers are uh, have uh, everything they say, every word out of their mouths is just a watered down version of what we were saying 10 years earlier. So uh, welcome to the new episode uh, for this week brought to you by our subscribe star backers. Uh, Subscribe to our subscribe star, donate and become pay pig to find out what everyone else will be saying in the coming years uh, and get uh, all the delightful videos that um, that you aren't allowed to admit that you listen to. Whoa, that's not good. Why, why come? I don't know. Because, because of your sexual preferences, something like that, whatever, anyways. Uh, just continuing with CAD month, maybe wrapping up CAD month. It's been three or episodes. It's that's CAD month, or is it rather it's loss month? Loss month, yeah, that's actually more. 15 odd. year anniversary of loss. Which is pretty much all anyone remembers about this comic. And uh, get, getting into this one is just here's text that says artist expressive sadness, expresses sadness for wife's miscarriage. And then the whole internet for 10 years is guy <laughs> weans laughing over her. <laughs> body doubled Jesus. over over uh, uh on the fucking gurney he's on the gurney as she's also on the gurney maybe they both need it maybe she should Leaning make space over. yeah he he might need a, a doctor i don't need no doctor and that's good uh the, so yeah that's uh just people enjoying a good long laugh at the comics expense it, apparently even buckley made fun of it uh, in the ensuing years, I mean, ten years is a long time to look back on this kind of shit. On the one hand, I would, uh, I can kind of respect and appreciate that. On the other hand, why do you make the comic at all to begin with? Yeah, that? why, why did you make your funny lol gamer gagaday comic suddenly about your wife's miscarriage? It seems like an odd place. Your ear in real life wife's in yeah. real life miscarriage. You're dragging and dropping clip art to make a fucking comic about it. It just it seems it just raises too many questions. And you couldn't even attempt to it doesn't even have to be a, a funny joke, but just if you're gonna fucking include that in the comic you're no, making it canon. You actually add a comment about it or it, commentary. Yeah, it's just straight up. Well, I think he was being tasteful uh, by not adding commentary or but not. In that case, it makes it less tasteful. Yes, it, it's Control Alt Delete. It's a, there's nothing tasteful about making anything for Control Alt Delete, especially I, at I think that time. I, I'm trying to remember because we were mentioning the fucking uh, cartoon show that was on YouTube. Yeah, that pain. People would have annotations for the thing. And in fact, I think they ended up saving the annotations when it turns out the annotations were going to be deleted, and they uploaded the video with the annotations. I think that but, was before Loss, uh, also, because what Loss was two thousand nine or something, and the YouTube annotations they got YouTube got rid of annotations in like two thousand seven or eight. Well, no, it was after that, but it was I don't know about pretty that. soon after that, and yeah, uh, they had them. For a while, and they were pretty funny and interesting. And you know, creators could actually put stuff onto their own videos to edit them after the fact if they wanted to, which was a good thing. And then YouTube was like, "No, we're not doing that anymore." And I still don't know why exactly. Well, there's there's a lot of potential reasons for why, but I don't I don't know. There's the potential reasons for why, but there's no actual reasons yeah. for why. Yeah, that's that is tends to be how YouTube works, of course. You den tube. Um. But just uh, here's the next one though is the game and there's <laughs> red the the letters have red lines that form lost which is again sort of a mixing of memes the game lost the game meme goes way way back even to before loss um, mm -hmm. because it's like going back to 2006 or earlier yeah it was it was it were really kind of a stupid borderline forced one except it caught on with a lot of the 
lol like random most nerds. memes it was forced uh, uh, to the point where it caught on yeah um but the the point of it was uh uh like saying you just lost the game and it's like what game the game of not having been told that you lost the game essentially and so it just got shortened to lost the game and then lost it's sort the, of like TV the show don't look the at game. this chicken yes. uh, don't look at this chicken and then it's just a picture of a chicken with the words don't look at this chicken in the middle right no, over the chicken no it's it's the game is called don't look at this chicken game and it's a picture of the chicken in the middle of the chicken says game over because <laughs> now you've looked at the chicken uh, that's what even lost if you're just was. trying to look at what the next bit of text says yes, if, if you're right looking, over the chicken but i mean the the point is you weren't supposed to look at the chicken now you did so you lost and that's basically what lost the game is is just being pointed out that you, you lost the game is now informing you that you were ever playing a game in the first place and it's already over so that was kind of the joke of the meme and then mixing that with loss the actual meme i think there's more backstory to it but i don't know it but it's like, a, oh, this is based on such and such. It's from such an old meme. Something time. awful or some yeah. bullshit like that. I don't, I don't give a shit. I All I remember is I was up. on fucking V in like 2006. It was on V. The fucking just you lost the game. It's just like the the game. As soon as you see the game, or people the would be hiding meme is you just lost the game. Yeah, people would be but hiding no. the words the game in a picture file somewhere people would or get the angry, file yeah. name. People were getting angry about it because, like, no, why'd you do that? Ugh, or they would be, the they would be like, pretending. Just fucking text. It's it, text on a fucking image file. People would be pretending that they were getting angry because that was kind of the point of the joke also. And I'm then sure I think people to, were actually getting angry yeah, at some point. Yeah, at some point. People were like, I've been, no, I've been doing good so far on this time, which... Again, that could be a joke. It could be some. Or it's like serious... the it's like the chain letter. The fucking this will kill you. Uh, repost this, or your mom will die in her sleep. Yeah, and it's, it's like, like oh I no, I have to it. do it. Oh no. Oh no, I didn't repost it. My mom didn't die in her sleep. This chain letter is such bullshit. This is fucking bullshit. Fucking asshole. Anyways, um, the, here's the next one, which is just JoJo. Fucking, it's JoJo, sort of drawn and recolored to be uh, Buckley and but also reorganized so now it's just two panels uh, much more dynamic yeah, three of the panels are just in the second panel yes and I think he's apparently stopping time to avoid the doctor and the receptionist to immediately so walk into the room yes um, and then the here's this one with a uh, 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 Guy from a fighting game. I, don't I think care. that's Terry from yeah. not Guilty Gear, but uh, Terry Crews. King of Fighters or something. One of those button masher, the cheap shot, uh, instant win, I win button. Yeah, which fighting uh, video games is apparently what he's doing to everyone in all of the panels here, including the last one, is doing some kind of diving fist move. Very tragic. He's, he's fucking delivering some massive attacks. The, the last panel is the best part, of yes, course. Just, I know. Otherwise, this would just be a, a, another example of some of the many, many, many random, bizarre e uh, edits that were made out of this. Uh, there are many more examples. Here are just a few thousand examples. Um, but yeah, the uh, I, I blocked out the memory and information of this game because I don't give a shit. Hey, man. I don't Who'd know if I've kids? ever even played it. Was it King of Fighters or some no, shit? Yeah, like I know I've never played King of Fighters. I've never played... Uh, yeah, no, I, I don't give a shit. Uh, some of those other stupid games that suck. Uh, to me, fighting games are like... It's like a mini game you'd find in another game. And then yeah. people... This is a fucking entire video game by itself. No, it isn't. No, sorry, I mean, it's you, not. You can play that. If you wanted to play the snowboarding from Final Fantasy VII... As a whole entire video game, you yeah. could do that. That's the, well, that's I the mean, perfect equivalent. That's what every fighting game is, essentially. Yes. That, that is essentially what the... Remember Final Fantasy VII's minigames? They had a billion of them. There was the fucking submarine minigame that you could replay in the Golden Saucer. Yeah, the submarine that shit was minigame. awesome. Yeah, the snowboarding... The, the, uh, There's the motorcycle chase scene. That was uh, like a minigame. That was basically like... The, there was yeah. the Chocobo racing. There was an racing. arcade in the Golden Saucer and you could replay every single fucking minigame that was in Final Fantasy ah, 7. Wonderful. Classic. 
uh, fighting games, yeah, are basically just taking one of those mini games and selling it as a full game. Wow, what a, what a novelty! Why do people like that? I don't know. The gay? But yeah, people telling you uh, a lot of the people telling you that such and such game is bad. Uh, people who are telling you that they boycotted uh, Fallout Three are the kind of people who are like, oh, a new fucking Pokemon game or uh, a Tekken Nine or whatever the fuck. At least Tekken, one of the Tekken games, had an actual beat 'em up side scroller as one of the parts of the game. It's like, oh, finally they made a real game based off of this engine. Finally, it happened. Finally, once. For once. For once. Anyway, so uh, we're uh, uh, you know we'll do uh, one more episode after this to to wrap up Lost Month. They may go over two months. I don't know. We just schedule them whenever they, they come out, whenever they're done. Whatever. Anyways. So, uh, again, donate to our subscribe star for your only hope for a future and to find out what everyone else will be saying in the coming years. And for everyone else, should have listened to shitty webcomics.